Win for a wonderful audience. We run, we win. American lamb. We're going to make American lamb. <laughs> Veal, I believe that's what it's called. Um, burgers. Uh, I'm not liking, well, let's see. Our ranchers, that's a lot of fat in their calories, but we're at 80%. Yeah, I get to 90, look for 90 next time. But anyways, praise the Lord. Let's see what this is going to taste like. Okay, this is it. It came in a nice little easy, uh, easy open thing. But since we're doing this for the first time, veal burgers for the first time, we're just going to do some simple season all salt, hamburger, grill mates, and uh, organic dill weed. Well, just dill weed, whatever. So these are the flavors we're going to use because we want to see how this tastes without adding all the awesome stuff we normally add to stuff. <laughs> well, guys. It Smells divine. You see all the little little things in there. Woo! Now it's time to form the patties. Well, I'm gonna mash this up a little bit more. Then it's time to form the patties. I guess we're gonna start with an ungreased skillet, and we're gonna put it on uh, medium after we get the uh, patties in there. Well, the, the 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 sticky part is done. So now we put this on medium. Four, and we'll start the timer for 20 minutes and so not 25 20 minutes and we'll just have to spot spot check this right <laughs> but anyways 20 minutes that should do well you know you always cook this stuff till the juices run clear don't be no blood guys juices have to run clear as the boss is not beating blood we ain't vampires we ain't Satanists <gasps> We are at the 15 minute time. Oh, oh look at that. Oh, isn't that wonderful? Uh, I think I'll smash them down a little bit because I like my burgers. I like my burgers being, um, uh, I don't like them being greasy. And if I can press some stuff down, press some stuff out of it, and I'll press some stuff out of it, right? I mean, who am I kidding, right? So, press it. Yeah, get some of that fat out of there. Next time I'll, I didn't buy <laughs> And then you may always go for the, the most you can, the leanest, the leanest, the leanest. Guys, 10, 10, 10, 10 minutes. Oh, look at this, this is great. I'm pressing this down. You know what, I think I'm a, oh, do you see that splatter up? You know what, I think I'm going to drain some of this. I'm gonna flip this over and drain some of this stuff out. Yeah, okay. Time to flip these over. <laughs> uh, we'll flip it over after I drain this stuff. Okay. We we I, I emptied the stuff out, and now and I re I added a minute to the timer. Now I'm flipping them, now I'm flipping these over. I'm like I, I gotta pay attention to the camera. I'm holding this thing in my cell phone. Uh, Flip these over, praise the Lord. They look really, really nice. They smell great. But now we're gonna smash them down. See, look at that, more of that stuff coming out. See, that's why I'm smashing them down. You don't need blood in your food, guys. So that's what we're doing. We're smashing this and clearing out this blood, this fat. So that. And now we got 10 more minutes on this side. Praise the Lord. Three minutes. I forgot to do it at five. Let's press down a little bit more. Look at all this grease, y'all. See, it's not a joke. This is not a joke. Sorry, it seems like things are down. So look at all this grease. Oh, well, praise the Lord. We can squeeze it out, all that mess. Woohoo! This is an aside, but this is a pan of bell sweet potato pie. Ah! Well, guys, we have completed our round of these. And then the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to transfer to a plate. And I'll put them on a plate. And I'll put some these. This is ground tea. This is not product placement. But um, now I'm going to smash. I'm going to push press down on them so I can get as much of this stuff out. That's why I get 98. I try to get 95 to 98% meat because all this extra fat. This, I mean, who cares if you start with you know, a whole pound of meat if one third of it comes out because you, you're using 66% fat. I mean, that means that what's the point of that? So you're actually, that all turns into fat. So anyway, so 
that's the next step and I'll see you when it's time for assembling them for dinner as far as this part's concerned. Oh y'all, oh here they are, oh praise the Lord. Oh that grease, they smell so wonderful. This is why I press them out between two plates. I mean, you know, so that's why I prefer to get, you know, the 95, 95 minimum. <laughs> but anyways, you know, lean, but it's, they smell awesome, 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 awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but they still say smell awesome. So guys, this is what they look like. And of course, we're making french fries because who makes hamburgers without french fries? I mean, come on. And of course, basically, these are just Florida Golden State fries. Just follow the instructions, guys. You'll be fine, okay? And oh, here's another tip. If you don't like doing dishes and like I, like I do, uh, if you don't like doing dishes, like I don't care to do dishes, put a aluminum foil on the bottom, Reynolds wrap, and then spray it with some spray. Uh, let's see. Uh, Jesus is Lord. Wait, who is this? Pam. Yeah, he's some Pam. That are good. Look at all this stuff. What was that? This thing. Look at this. Vitamins. Nyquil. Jesus is healing. So you just want to see what was in my cupboard. So there it is. Because you want wasn't one a day. That's not mine. That's my mother. She's visiting. And these are awesome too because they just are. <laughs> They're chewable and not the stuff you have to just uh, swallow down. And they have about the exact same and sometimes more than the other stuff. So hey, hey, get what works. Anyways, and so let's we'll stick this in here. And follow the instructions. And that should be that. What, the, what do the instructions say? Uh, 450 for full bag, 23 for so. 34 minutes. I just told you to follow the instructions, but I'm just going to put this on 35 minutes. <gasps> Well, guys, the, the this the stuff the, the our fries have come out. So the best time to season fries is right after. I don't usually put any seasoning on fries, but if you like them, but if you like to have a little season taste, I would suggest just a little bit of season off, just a little bit afterwards, and that's the extent that we put on the French fries. Of course, that'll be another day what I actually put on French fries, but I decided to throw this on there because. Uh, season fries, woohoo! And yes, y'all, we have completed the veal, the veal burger, and it is delicious. So congratulations, this is the end of the video, and it's awesome. It tastes better than a regular hamburger, y'all. The Lord is good. God knew what he, God knew what he was talking about when he said, kill that lamb for the Passover. <laughs> Well, Lord bless y'all. Remember, live, move, be.